Hey guys, how's it going? Manicato back once again, this time with Delude Succubus. Succubus? Succubus Prison. Succubus are demons. Female vampires who invade the dreams of men to get sex with them and steal their vital energy. Luz D is 31 and was seduced by three of these vampires. He is isolated inside a succubus prison in which the night never ends. Your mission is to try and escape unraveling the puzzles to destroy the free hearts of these seductive vampires. So yeah, it's a, a different game to say the least. It's quite voluptuous. I don't even know if that's a word. I just randomly decided to make it up. But essentially, we're looking at a puzzle game here. It's not so much... It says it says on the store description it's kind of crazy, but crazy on the nudity and stuff. But it's really not. It's just... Just a puzzle game, and god, the menu here is just absolutely terrible to try and navigate through. So essentially, we're stuck on the keyboard, which is like A, S, D, and yeah, so we're just looking at some of the characters here. You know, Framaniza, Ziza Nefert, Louise D, D's Nuts, Beldazi. Just, you know, she destroys her victims and collects her bones. First appears, blah blah blah, slip, blah blah blah, Alexa. Foundation of Brazil colony, you know, it's just random shit. From Niza Ziza Nefert, age approximately 4,000 years. Ziza Nefert is of Egyptian Arigem and possess a horde of succubus to his con- wait, shouldn't it be her control? Okay, she does not into- anyway. Let's uh, get into this game. Let's go. I'm clicking the wrong- uh, God damn it, I'm clicking the wrong things. It's difficult. Right, hey, go, start. The Ray of the Night. A shadow moves in the darkness. It's the Queen Sorceress Succubus from Menezes and the Furt. She is a charm of beauty and wisdom of darkness. The silence is broken by his words. Her words, for fuck's sake. Foolish man does not know the Ray of the Night. Meanwhile, Louise D responds only with a suspicious, deeply thoughtful look. Alright, so I'm going to move the mouse over there because I realised it was just kind of in the way. And this is, uh, this is there. The animations are a bit dodgy. So we're jumping over here onto the rock and yeah, it's A, C and V and yeah, it's just really shitty layout on the keyboard. It's annoying. And next to D, which you move to, which you use, I don't, I don't even know. You use A, S, D, Z, X, C. And if you press F, it goes full screen, small screen. It's really damn annoying. But, um, yeah, so we're slowly dragging this rock over here to be able to get up onto there. So, you know, the things you'll do for some succubi. That is a, that is a singular of succubus. That's kind of... The destiny revealed. You have vitality. I do not intend to kill you. But my subordinates have other plans. Awaken, what is the statue and come with me, my oh, stupid man. Luz D seems to have no qu options against the magnetism of malicious vampires. Right, okay. So, look at that, we teleported over here, I think, so that teleporter somewhat. We start climbing the wall. Oh yeah, let's climb the wall. But yeah, this game makes you really think. It, it there's no like direction is basically you have to work it out for yourself um i had one run before this so i fortunately i kind of knew the opening bit um i'm only going to be showing level one on this this video level two is kind of a bit too raunchy i had to cut it out so yeah but this one ain't too bad thankfully it's just you know just platforming and basically essentially what the game is it's really clunky platformer puzzler it's just really really clunky so we press X on this to destroy it. It's like a weird terminal. I don't know what it does. But apparently it's a thing. Jump up here and we have to kick this pillar down. Oh god. There we go. It's just so clunky and ugh. Jump across here to this statue where we kind of... We just gotta do some sort of kick thing. It should activate it somehow. Ah, so clunky. Do I push it? Do I kick it? God. This is so... There we go, finally. And, yeah, this scene I can show you is something... Bad. But basically it's a minigame where you tap A and X over and over, and the picture in the middle of someone... Um, 
saying hello to someone else just slowly moves it don't, it don't even move it just kind of I don't know but yeah it's, it's I think they're playing uh oh, what's that game with the colors we have to you know write them out but anyway that went on for two minutes so we cut it down to like 25 seconds because you know I'm not gonna make you watch a blurred screen for two minutes for fuck's sake and it was really kind of meh anyway so yeah you do that little scene there AX 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 and now we're back out so my idea is to pull this statue on the the levitating platform which is coming up and down and then bring it up to the top and hopefully that should bring on the next level so there you go there's the platform oh it's so clunky to move this character jesus look at that oh fuck right no worries we're gonna try and just um drag it on for god's sake oh, i got to kick it there we go oh shit I've got no way of getting... There we go. We, we managed to get a kick off right there. I have to wait for it to come back down. Jeez. Yeah, so it's... It's a really... Like, if you're into kind of... Just... Really clunky... Old-style platformer... Puzzler games, and This will probably be right down your alley. You know? This... Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, I found a really clunky. I think it actually gave me a headache as well, to be honest. Um, and yeah, it's, it's just kind of, yeah, it's different. That's I, I like the kind of the whole puzzle part to it, but everything else about the game is pretty shit, unfortunately. But at least the puzzle kind of part was cool. Um, yeah, we're climbing up. Starting to find out where this platform is right now. There's actually a there's a Easter egg on the end of this video from the next level. I um yeah I did something bad. Basically, you, you go into the mini games pressing the AX AX. You know where you you're playing the uh, the color game or whatever it's called. Where you're just doing yoga together. You press AX, 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 you fill the meter up and you're meant to stop, but I didn't stop and I guess I got drained. I guess I got drained of energy from doing yoga too much. I guess. Oh, and I see, and the thing is, the, the full screen window, this freaking F button, so I kept clicking that as well all day, all night, trying to bloody awkwardly kick this freaking statue onto the bloody platform. Ugh. So yeah, the movements on this game are really really clunky so if you want a solid smooth platform this is definitely not it and if you just want a game where you just want to fuck some shit i guess this is not it either <laughs> just uh, throwing that one out there you know just kind of casually just throwing that one out there for you horn dogs but um yeah here you go. let's break the break the floor down i wonder what the statue is doing it looks like it's kind of blowing on a vuvu salad doesn't it just blowing a horn Summoning the call of the the wraiths, you know. Maybe it just wants to, like it wants to get to the top of this place to do a loud, a loud shout it's like, "Hey, I am the world." God, she is like calling me, isn't she? She wants to do something. So, uh, so God, God damn it! It's so freaking awkward and clunky. But yeah. You can get this game on Steam right now. But um all the information's down below, just click show more and there we go. She happily got to blow her horn and her trumpet. That's it, I'm out. You know, this 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 actual game drained me instead of the succubus. But yeah, enjoy the rest. You were consumed. <laughs>